I didn't care. You become a celebrity. Maybe. What do you mean? Yeah. She's all over, all over media. That's good. <laughs> Where do you see me? Where did you but see me? But I need me? to deal with her. She's yeah, been you... having too much, too many fights on social media. Uh, what, what, what fights are you talking about? When did you fight? Yeah. Who did she fight with? Yeah, yeah ask, him. ask him. Ask him. I'll show you the video. Who did you fight with? <laughs> Hi guys, so um, a quick intro. I am doing the NPACT, the NPACT challenge. Basically, NPACT is just a group of entrepreneurs from um, Africa, different countries in Africa. So Rwanda, um, Uganda, Tanzania, Tunisia, Mozambique, uh, uh, Zimbabwe, and guys from Europe, so Germany, um, uh, Germany, France, uh, there's one from Finland, and then the others from the UK. We, are all, we all met in August. We all met in August in Berlin for the start of the startup challenge. So basically just different entrepreneurs um, coming together and working towards how can you make your business better? How can you make your business grow? So we had that in August in Germany, Berlin. So this year um, we're having it in Kenya. So basically it's the same program that's continuing, but this is like the culmination of everything. This is like the graduation. So we are, uh, we've met today on Monday. This is going to be a whole week of another rigorous um, another rigorous uh, stay uh, we're going to be staying at the Maasai Lodge until Friday where we'll just be doing different classes um, looking at how far have you come because all of us have mentors who mentor us um, on how to run our businesses basically so right now this is a surprise lunch no one knew that we're coming here at Matt Brown's for lunch so we're here for lunch and then we go to Maasai Lodge and then there's a whole program here oh that's my card but there's a whole program here of um, of the activities that are going to be here for the week so I don't think I will have the camera throughout because I'm here to learn that's the biggest thing here is about learning and just seeing how well can I grow the Grace Cup as a brand so um, I'm going to capture as much as I can and I will see you when I see you You will not be in this picture. I am. Hey, Peter. Uh, hey, Jora. What you... Guys, guys, make sure you are close to your home. Good to see you. I have a lot to tell you about my KPIs. Yeah, I do that. <laughs> I'll shoot guys. It is day three of the camp and as expected I am exhausted 
and when I say exhausted, I mean seriously exhausted. Uh, yesterday, because our sessions, the last session is usually at 8.30, right after dinner. It's more like relaxed and networking and stuff, but I couldn't do it. I had to excuse myself. I stayed for like half of it and I was like, guys, I have to go to bed. So um, at least I went to bed early because if you've been following my channel, you know that I usually sleep at nine. But now it comes here and I sleep at like 11, 12. So it's too much for me, um, but it's all good. So today I slept a bit early. I slept at around 10.30. So right now it's seven in the morning and I want to go for a run because I feel like if I start my day with some exercise, then then I guess I won't be as exhausted as I've been feeling. I think it's because just my day is thrown around too much. It's not my average day at home in the office. Maybe that's why this is happening. But anyways, um, I just wanna go for a quick run, a bit of stretch, and then get ready for another beautiful day. came from running then I found myself my friend swimming and I was like <laughs> you guys are swimming and I don't have my swimming costume I only have my gym clothes and I was like you know what I am joining so I joined them and this was like the best idea ever the water is not so cold it's 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 okay um, I just finished swimming they've already left I also need to go um, and shower and get ready for the day be able to from school to school, talking to the girls and boys about menstruation and not just leaving them with information, but actually empowering them with a cup that they can stay with and use it for the next 10 years. My name is Abiru Ime, founder of The Grace Cup, and I am open to any questions. Thank you. Because Abby didn't have any slides, she was like in contact, told the story and we were all listening. Good morning! It is day four. It is day four of the camp. I am running for breakfast. I did not go, I did not go running or exercise um, today because last night we, I slept, most of us actually slept at around one. We went to bed at one in the morning because we had this really heated but very respectful discussion on, um, on race and gender. Uh, I was chosen to moderate the topic on race and it was just it, it was just very eye-opening as to how white people see or consider black people and the other way around and just coming up with um, discoveries that we never really even thought about like it was it was very respectful and it was very open and maybe one day I'm going to share about those insights but right now, like I said, I am rushing for breakfast and we'll see, we'll see how the day goes. 